Um, I am doing this video. Uh, first off, I'd like to state that this is something I would never want to put up online. There's This is something uh, I would have never thought existed before I experienced it. Um, it is simply put a terrifying uh, experience to go through and then to realize and to read other people's stories and to see what happened to me is almost textbook comparison to other so-called uh, they're deemed targeted individuals which I now thoroughly understand what that means now and I am one being a targeted individual sucks there's no other way to put it. Um, to realize, I suppose I, I wanted to do this video more to talk about what happened to me, but I'd rather not because if you do talk about what happens, it the, the, the tactics of organized gang stalking and electronic harassment, they're all sort of made to mimic uh, uh, Mimic, mimic what would be their paranoid schizophrenia or psychosis or delusion. So I'd rather not talk about what happened to me. I'd rather not talk about what happened to me. I, I'm just going to make a quick video more and talk about more of how unsettling and how just soul-shattering to realize that there are forces and there are people out there that are this evil and this sadistic and this cruel and if you go on my website and my blog and see some of the people who I was up against uh, it might give some more validation to my particular story of being a targeted individual um, I uh, was involved in an estate case my father passed away when I was a little girl and my sister and I were little girls and we were the state's sole heirs, and unknowing to us, our father was uh, cremated immediately. All his belongings were taken away, and we never heard back from anybody. And my grandmother hired a, a powerful lawyer from a law firm that all has CIA connections. Uh, the lawyer that has my father's stock book also has close CIA connections. They represent uh, Blackwater. They represented Blackwater in the New Source Square incident. Um, so hopefully that'll give some valid validation to my personal experience. I am looking forward to after uh, healing from what's happened to me. Um, it's going to take a while, but I know I know I'm going to get better. I mean, I am better. I'm just, I think you kind of go through a shock period when you realize, oh my God, um, there are people that are this evil. And the tactics behind the gang stalking is to make you feel uh, just like your life isn't important that, you know, it's sort of either push you to suicide or to acting out, and I'm not going to commit suicide. The closer I got in my investigations, they would, more the, the tactics of the gang stalking, uh, they would escalate the events. Um, and the evil of it is just earth shattering, soul shattering, heart shattering, heart breaking. I can't even really put it in words. I need to actually write this stuff down before I blog about it. Video blog about it.